Okay, so welcome back to more Breaking Bad Reactions. We're on Season 5, Episode 3 today. Last episode, it was dedicated a lot to Mike. It centred around Mike a lot. But I didn't take away from the episode. Like, usually I feel like with TV shows, if you was to centre it around a character that anyone other than the main character, it usually isn't as good or it's, like, noticeable that it's... It's noticeable compared to the other episodes. Like, it's usually worse than the other episodes. But it wasn't the case with this one because they develop characters so well. Mike's so well developed, so you don't notice stuff like that. Like, it all blends into one. Um, every character's as well developed as each other. So, whereas it was heavily focused around Mike, it didn't take away from the episode at all. I think we barely saw Walt last episode, from what I can remember. It was just focused around Mike and how his, his guys are being stripped to their money and then they're, they're going to extreme lengths to look after themselves. Like, one of them even tried to off Mike. Um, didn't end well for him, never going to end well if you try and kill Mike. But the thing is, with Mike, I feel like eventually he will... I don't know, I don't know, I can't see him dying. I can't see Mike dying, but I can see something going down with him. The thing with Mike is I can't see him surviving too long. You know what I mean? It's getting to the end of the show now and they start taking big jumps near the end of, uh, near the end of TV series. Characters die left, right and centre. Drop like flies. The thing is with Mike, I can't ever picture him dying. But at the same time, I know he's not going to stick around. They had that thing last episode where he said to Walt, um, you're a ticking time bomb, basically, and I, I'm not going to be around for you for it to go off. Like, I'm not going to be around for that. And now he started to work for uh, for Walt because money's getting tight and all that. Um, so I feel like that was, a, that was foreshadowing what's to come. I feel like Mike is going to fall eventually. The downfall of Mike will be Walt, like it has been with everyone so far. Everyone Walt gets involved with ends up uh, fucking falling in some way, aside from Jesse. So it's just inevitable at this point, but how that's going to happen, I have no idea. And it's so weird to say that Mike is working for Walt, of all people. Like, it's just, it's so weird to see how far uh, Walt's come. I was watching, actually, last night, when I was just bored, I was just watching episode one and two of Breaking Bad again, season one, episode one. And fucking hell, the the difference in, in Walt is insane. The the character in this show is incredible. And I actually noticed something as well. I actually know I'm, I'm already starting to notice stuff. This is just the first episode. In episode one, he, on his plate, um, when Skylar makes him breakfast, it has 50. So it's his 50th birthday in that episode. And then in episode one of season one, uh, episode one of season five, I think it says 52, right? Made out of bacon. So that is literally an exact same shot of the first episode, recreated. That is fucking sick. Like, I'm, I've only just watched back one episode and I'm already noticing stuff already. So I, it is going to be so fun to even rewatch this show. Uh, and notice all the shit that they've planted there from day one like incredible show but yeah not gonna ramble for too long i'm actually really excited to see where this episode goes so as always before i start these videos i'll be a few episodes ahead of this episode on my patreon it'll be the full uncut episode so it'll be my reaction to the entire episode if you are interested in that the link to my patreon will be down below in the description but as for now i hope you enjoy the video oh he's the laundry anyway really? yeah of course Just trust Mike. Who's next? Uh, that's your choice. Uh, APD's got Martinez across town. Ah, uh, fuck. All of these guys have been nicked. That's oh, so his guy and making sure all of these guys aren't snitching on him. I mean, would you snitch on Mike? I fucking wouldn't. The guy will off you. He will have you killed in some way. You could. You may think you're secure, but nah, he will have you killed. Is that Jesse? Oh no, it's just... I thought it was Jesse sleeping, it's just fucking... Oh god, what's his name? Hugh something? He said he was gonna break my legs. And don't tell me he didn't mean it, okay? Cause he gave me these dead mackerel eyes. He meant it, so... Mike threatened me. He threatened Jesse. He probably threatened someone before breakfast this morning. <laughs> he does. He's, yeah, he just he threatens everyone. <laughs> Hugh believes he stands a chance against Mike. Uh, here are the ground rules: division of labor. I handle the business. Making the stuff. That's your end. Are you okay with that? Yes, he handles the business. Ooh, shit. Bro, what, how small got to this position? You just think of all the events that have played out. It's just like... Fine, fine, moving on. Ooh, 
Where is their next operation place going to be? I'm... It's going to be interesting. Been driving around all night, fucking late. Why is he obsessed with laser tag? Now maybe there's a strange smell coming from there. Someone think to investigate? Mm. Don't even go inside. Hell, no. Yeah. That's where we'll go. What the fuck, man? Then and out, yes, but it's like a lab book or anything. That seems very. It's a challenge, right? Yeah. Pest control operation is legit. I mean, they're licensed, they're bonded, they're themselves. And you know them how? Well, I've been uh, pulling their chestnuts out of the fire, legally speaking, for uh, five years. Ira and his guys are good. I mean, they know how to keep their mouths shut. Wonder if we'll see more of that in Better Call Saul then. That is going to be risky though, moving in and out. But if Walt says it's a good idea, it's a good idea. Hey, Skinny Pete's back! When was the last time we saw him? Fuck's sake. Badger, mate, what are you doing? Height is good, width is good. How much weight was this all? It's rated for 900 pounds, so unless you're banned. Oh, they're helping Jesse, aren't they? I'm gonna need a four of them. Four? That gonna be layaway, because I need to see a bunch of IDs for that. Oh, man, cash. Okay, hey, uh, you know what? I'll throw in stenciling. What's your band called? Are you take? Are you fucking kidding me? If there's ever anything else you need from us, mm. any way we can get in on this? <laughs> I love you two, but no, come on. Time to time, you're gonna see these two. As far as you're concerned, they are ghosts. You don't see them, you don't hear them, you don't say good morning. Need a name for them? You call him yes, sir, and no, sir. Wow, what a fucking speech, man. He's just too tall. You know, I thought we'd put a collar on the tank and carry the motor in separately alongside the condenser. You know, on a day, we just kind of twist it into place. You know, while we're setting up. Yeah, yeah. Wow, for the first time, he agrees with Jesse. He's not like, no, nah, you can't do that. About you. Yeah, you fucking poisoned him, you scumbag. Why don't you stay for a beer at least? Sure, why not? It's like the only time he's he's actually hung out with Jesse as well. So you're gonna get him all, right? We'll kill him dead. That's a guarantee. This this seems very like not secure. I don't know. I just have a bad vibe about this. What the fuck would I know though? This just seems odd. It's like a fucking GTA mission. I wonder what's going to go wrong with this one. You know it's going to go wrong eventually. I said it seems kind of sus to begin with though. Like it doesn't seem secure. But I mean it's all they've got at the minute isn't it? I love their montages. It's so satisfying to watch. I don't think you tell her everything, mate, because, I mean, that wouldn't want to make anyone stay around. With the baby and Walt? Skylar, you're not smoking around the baby, are you? And you can't smoke here. Just chill. Rule or regulation. Marie. Shut up. Mom. Yeah, literally just shut up for a minute. I'm sorry, please don't speak to me like that. I am simply saying that you Will you shut up? Hey. Shut the hell up. Hey. up. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> well then, fucking hell. <laughs> Marie, you do talk a bit too much, you know. Where's Skylar? In the bedroom, she's resting. I'm not leaving here until I know where Marie is. What's your lie gonna be? It's time to tell me the truth, Walt. All of it. <laughs> you ain't getting the truth. <laughs> you ain't getting the truth. What's his lie gonna be now? Come on, Walt. What you gonna? What bullshit are you gonna spin now? Four weeks back, I took a fall of bad luck. But that couldn't explain Skylar's. Uh, yes, he 
Easy good. Uh, oh, right, I see what he's doing. You do know, right? Well, you are, <laughs> you are one son of a bitch. Made her out to be the bad guy. That's how it's always been seen, isn't it? It's always Skylar that's, that's seen as the bad one, Walt's seen as the good. I'm I'm happy for Jesse that he's got something you like. He's got things seem to be going well for him at the minute. Bro, Skylar's really going through it. I love that transition. Uh, I you're short. Almost three hundred thousand short. You're forgetting about the mules. They get a flat twenty percent. What? Transportation is worth twenty percent. They're taking a risk. What did Gus pay his mules? Gustavo Fring didn't need mules. He didn't need them. He spent 20 years building his own distribution. He had 16 refrigerator trucks running his product. You don't like paying 20%. Maybe you shouldn't have killed the guy. Hey. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. That's for one cook. For him and me, 120. Okay. Now, well, it's getting really gets fucking for our piece big freeze boots. 20. Goodman's cut, eighteen thousand from each. Um, none of their money's gone to them. Legacy cost, three hundred and fifty-one thousand dollars. That's one hundred and seventeen thousand each. Legacy cost? I got nine guys. You don't know them, but they were part of the previous operation, and they know a lot. We are going to make them whole. We are going to make them whole. What is this we? So what are they doing to further our interests? The cops are looking at them very closely. We don't want them further. Uh, Walt's not going to like this. So we are paying them. To keep their mouth shut. But to keep their mouth shut. It's what you do. We're paying for their silence. That's blackmail. Business is my end. Fucking well, mate, dude. Hey, hey, stick out of my way. No, Jesse, man, no, no, Jesse, no, 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 bro. I don't care. No, 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 Jesse, no, man. You, you deserve. You earned it. Just because you shot Jesse James, you don't like him, does he? Fucking hell! He don't like hearing that. He wants to. He wants to hear that he is the kingpin. Walt's gonna do something about. Walt's gonna have these guys off the. I, I don't know what he's gonna do. I don't know what he's gonna do, but he's gonna do something. Is that money even worth their risk? Bro, you might well just 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 slow down, yeah. Slow the fuck down. You are getting way too ahead of yourself at this point. Oh god, I just uh... even Jesse knows this guy is just he's loyal to the grave, but uh, even Jesse knows this guy is getting a bit too. But he doesn't even recognize him anymore. Is that going to close the episode? What a way to close the episode. Uh, I'm meant to be watching one episode of Breaking Bad, but I can't. I can't. I've got to watch another. This show is... It's, a, it's just addictive. It's so addictive. That was Breaking Bad Season 5, Episode 3. You know, you don't know what I'm going to say by now. Come on, I've, I've said it for pretty much every single episode I've watched now. Another good episode. Another good episode where everything is put there for a reason it's so weird seeing Walt talk down to Mike like and see Mike not want to like sock him in the mouth or whatever it's so weird and now his plan is to kill Mike or what the fuck are you plan it's not gonna be that easy no way is it gonna be that easy but 
Like, I expected... I said at the beginning of this episode, Mike will fall eventually. Like, I, I'm expecting that because it's just... Come on, you've had five seasons so far of people working with Walt and, and being affiliated with him, and they've died. Like, it, it's just happened. So, it's not going to be different with Mike, is it? I didn't expect Walt to be the one to sit there and think about offing him. Oh, God. Walt's seen that he's tried to work with Mike. He knows the business and all that, but it's just not going to work. Like, he's taking barely any money home for himself. In his eyes, barely any money. Walt is one of those one of those people where he, he will never be satisfied with what he has. Like, he, he always has to go the extra mile. He could be getting millions, millions to himself, and he will still want more. He's, he's just that sort of person, which is why he's going to get caught in the end. He's definitely going to get caught in the end, because we, we know we're led to believe that time and time again. Every single time he's done something good, he's just tried to more and more and more. He doesn't know when to stop. And it, it's just, it's going to keep going and going, isn't it? Like, you've also got to remember the scene in the first episode where he's got this new identity, this new look, he's in a new place. There's a reason for that. Something pushes him to do that. And we're seeing the start of that now. Um, what that is, I have no idea. I don't know when this, when Walt's going to try and off Mike. I don't know if Jesse's going to allow it to happen. Jesse probably will get in the way. Um... But in typical Breaking Bad tradition, I can't predict it. Um, so you, 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 you have an understanding of what's going to happen or what you think is going to happen, but you don't know how it's going to go down. That's the most exciting part. Like I always say, I meant to be watching one episode, but I can't help it. I've got to watch another. So that was Breaking Bad Season 5, Episode 3. I hope you enjoyed this video, and as always, cheers for watching.